Und damit herzlich willkommen zurück zu einer weiteren Runde von Baiten Kaitus hier auf der wunderschönen Insel in Neo, wo wir beim letzten Mal den Himmelsbaum zum Blühen gebracht haben. Da hinten steht er in voller Blüte. Und ähm, naja, wir müssen noch den Endmerknis an die Königin abliefern, um ihr zu beweisen, dass wir ihr doch die Wahrheit gesagt haben und sie uns ja nicht so geglaubt hat. Äh, jedenfalls gehen wir aber erstmal in die Kirche. Denn wie es sich gehört, werden wir in der Kirche ein wenig beten. Dann erhöhen wir unsere Level ein bisschen. Gleichzeitig sollten wir da auch gleich Kelles von der Verbrennung heilen. Die schleppt da jetzt nur schon eine ganze Weile mit sich herum. Oh, das ist ja wieder so zwei Level haben. Schelle auch, sehr schön. So. Äh, will ich hier was umbauen? Äh, ja, wir können die Lichter der Wahrheit rausnehmen. Wir haben bestimmt noch irgendwas, was wir da reinpacken können stattdessen. Na, ja, Kellis hat eigentlich schon genug zu malen. Der braucht eigentlich nicht noch unbedingt mehr. Kann eigentlich das, was er hat, dann wenigstens mal aufwerten. Seine drei Angeln. Na, eigentlich hat diese Giftblume, äh, diese verbleckte Blume, genauso viel Angriff wie ein Schwert. Können wir das stattdessen nehmen, bis wir halt ein bisschen mehr haben. Also, Scheller kann ihre Feuerkarten auch erstmal drin behalten. Wir haben ja einen Feuerabschlusszug für sie. Können sie den mal benutzen. Und wir packen wir die Windkarten rein. Es ist irgendwie witzig, dass wir nur drei Windkarten haben, ne? So, und Selina kann, glaube ich, erstmal bei Feuer bleiben. Das steht hier, glaube ich, ganz gut zu Gesicht. So, dann kehren wir mal zum Abenteuer zurück. Ich weiß ja nicht, wie sehr es ein Abenteuer ist, die Königin zu besuchen. Also, es ist bestimmt ein Abenteuer, für, wenn man in der Realität lebt, aber hier kann, kann scheinbar jeder zur Königin gehen, der gerade Bock drauf hat. Und noch fein die Treppe hoch. Guten Tag. Hi. Es tut mir leid, aber ich darf euch nicht passieren lassen. Wir sind hier, um Corellia zu sprechen. Ich habe ein Endmagnus mitgebracht. Es tut mir leid. Wenn ihr zu Königin Corellia wollt, müsst ihr euch offiziell anmelden. Schon gut. Lasst sie durch. Wie ihr wünscht. Na, ah, sehr schön. So this is one of the end magnus you were talking about? <gasps> oh my! Your... Your Highness! I wonder what the Queen could have seen. Who knows? But if the end Magnus did that to her, it can't be pretty. I agree. Do you think she'll be all right? Though she's graceful, Queen Corellia has a strong mind. The willpower of several men, or so I hear. Whatever the end Magnus has shown her, I doubt it could damage her seriously. Yeah. She'll be fine, right? Hey, Savino. Why don't you tell us about yourself? The where's and what's from before you came here. Hmm? What made you come here to Inue Inue? I'm all ears if you feel like talking. Hey, don't worry. I'm not suspicious of you. Just curious. If you don't want to talk, That's fine with me.
I drifted around from place to place, usually as a mercenary, protecting towns and caravans. That was more or less the life I was living for years. Then one day I came across a strange old woman. Heed my words. The celestial tree in Anuenue is host to a dreadful power hidden deep within its core. Before long, you will play your part in a great struggle over this power. The struggle alone will fill a great emptiness within you and ease your pain. A new annual awaits you. You must go. Go and face your destiny. If you wish to return to the life you once lived. And das war übrigens eine Zeile aus dem Opening, falls ihr euch erinnert. So I thought I might as well go see this tree she spoke of. I was headed nowhere. A soldier for hire, living an empty life one day after the next. It was easy to make such decisions at that time. I hardly had a care in this world. So, this old lady told you we'd be coming? Yes, a dreadful power lies sealed away within the celestial tree. A young girl and her companions, shouldering a great burden, will arrive to claim it. That's how she put it. A young girl and her companions, shouldering a great burden. Quite a story. You're a little strange yourself. Following a strange old lady's fortune and coming down here to live alone? Nothing mattered. Hmm? Nothing really mattered to me. Nothing at all. I was just waiting. Waiting for so long. For fate to open its doors and show me something worth fighting for. Her Highness Queen Corellia has regained consciousness. She wishes to speak with you all. Ja, dann gehen wir doch mal zu ihr. Lassen wir die gute Frau doch nicht warten. Da gehen wir. Da ist sie schon. How do you feel, your highness? I am all right. My apologies for worrying you. It seems what you told me about the legends in Diadem were indeed true. I'm sorry I doubted you. Please don't worry about it, Your Highness. No one would have believed such a wild story out of the blue like that. But is Emperor Geldoflame really trying to release that being? It's very likely. Two of the End Magnus have already been released. And they're in his hands as we speak. The Magnus you brought here, it's very dangerous. If the Emperor should claim all five of them and release their power, Malpercio, cursed god of old, might be resurrected. Malpercio, resurrected. Should Malpercio return, our world would be in great peril. I will send a messenger to King Ladikhan right away to discuss what action should be taken. The combined might of Anuanue and Diadem should be enough to keep the Empire at bay. That would help greatly. We must do our utmost to stop Geldoblame while there's still time. Three of the five N Magnus have been awakened. R, Le, and Che. The one we have is called Che. 
Two more to go. Yep, I say we go get the fourth one. We can't change what's happened. All we can do is find the other two and grab them before the Empire does. Rays of light shooting from the Magnus pointed in two directions. Mira and the Empire. Which of those should we head for first? I say Mira. Infiltrating the Empire would be too risky at this point. We lack the resources and logistics for such an operation. I'll be coming with you, of course. Soldiers can't leave the front lines in the middle of an operation. Besides, this fight is personal. Thanks! You'll be a great help, Savina. Yet another joins the Motley crew. Though I have to admit, she does pack a punch. Stop whining, kid. Just welcome Savina to the crew. Of course, we don't even know what your plans are. Okay, okay. Guess I'm going to. If only Giacomo would do me a favor and pop up again. He'd save me the trouble of hunting him down. By the way, our next destination, Mira. What exactly are we in for? Mira is the city of illusion. A very mysterious land. Its location shifts from time to time, going back and forth between our world and another dimension. You'll need to take the Trail of Souls there, a border between dimensions. But you should all get some rest before departure. Thank you, Your Highness. I, for one, will take you up on that offer. What you have accomplished was no easy feat. The road ahead may be even more perilous, but you're our only hope. Ach. Naja, wir haben uns ja schon beim Aufleveln geheilt, von daher brauchen wir diese Pause nicht unbedingt, aber halt, man nimmt sie dann doch gerne. Und wir stehen immer noch genau da, wo wir aufgehört haben mit dem Dialog. Jedenfalls, wir sind mit Enu Enu soweit durch, wir können uns hier äh, von hier verziehen. Und in die nächste... auf die nächste Insel reisen. Nämlich Mira. Das ist übrigens die Insel, wo Kellis herkommt, by the way. Also gehen wir mal los. Der Junge kann es bestimmt kaum erwarten, wieder zu Hause zu sein. Aber halt, wurde sein Zuhause nicht abgefackelt? Na ja, gut. Never mind, ich habe nichts gesagt. So, we'll be heading for Mira through the Trail of Souls. Are you ready to go? Kann losgehen. Right. Trail of Souls, here we come. Was denn Fahrt? Fahrt der Seele würde ich das nicht unbedingt nennen. Das ist mir ein LSD-Trip. while since I left. Say, why don't we take a stroll around the ship? It's getting pretty stuffy in here. Let's go. Hello, Shella. What hast du uns denn so schönes zu sagen? What's wrong, Callus? You look a little down. I hate being cramped up in small rooms. Not enough fresh air. Besides, I always get a little clammy going through the trail of souls. I don't know why. Hang in there. It'll pass. We don't have much of a choice now anyway. How are you doing? Uh, uns geht's gut. 
Well, there isn't much we can do until we reach Mira. Might as well get some rest while we can. Yeah, I suppose you're right. Na gut, wie geht's dir so? I wonder why they never came after us back in Anue Anue. Das ist wirklich eine berechtigte Frage. You think they would be chopping at the bit to get the end Magnus? They need all five for the Emperor's plans, don't they? Don't ask me. Maybe they don't need to worry about us anymore. Or maybe one of us is an Imperial spy. This is no laughing matter. I can't help but wonder about Savina. She just seems a little... something's not right. I know what you're getting at. She is a little on the shady side. I'll give you, but I'm not too sure about you either, Lude. I don't blame you. Till recently, I was indeed an Imperial officer. What do you think? Do you trust me? Hmm. Well, er nicht. Huh. Thought so. I don't trust him either. Really? Callus, we've been through this already. I, for one, believe in you, Lude. They're just edgy. Never mind what they say. Thank you, Shella. Did you hear that? She makes us sound like the bad guys. So, ich glaube, Sevina ist draußen, ne? Ja, lass sie. Wir haben hier sogar eine eigene Blume auf dem Schiff. What is it? No, nothing really. Well, okay, Savina. No offense, but I don't totally believe your story. I'd say the others feel the same way. Figures. But it's not important. I don't care whether you believe me or not. Just don't stand in my way. Friend or foe, stand in my way. And I'll take you out. You may not believe my story, but you'd best believe my warning for your own good. Hey, just because I don't fully trust you, it's not like I hate you. Und dann reden wir doch mal mit Gibari. So, die haben wir noch nicht geredet. What's up, Callus? No land in sight yet. Gibari, I've been thinking about Savina and you. Huh? What about them? Is it the trust issue? Once you doubt someone once, it grows and grows. That's human nature, kid. One could have similar doubts about Shella or you, you know. It ain't like we really know who you are. You don't trust me? <laughs> Just making a point. Don't take it personal. If you ask me, I'd say trust me. I'd rather give my trust and risk being deceived than live alone trusting no one my whole life. Wouldn't you agree? Of course, you gotta think twice if folks keep betraying you. Guess it's up to you. It's your life. Live it as you like. Yeah, I see what you're saying. Huh? Gibari? What is that? What do you see? A whale or something? <laughs> also, das ist definitiv kein Wahl. Das letzte Mal, als ich nachgeguckt habe, sahen Wale nicht so aus. Und die haben auch nicht auf Schiffe geschossen. Damn! It's the Goldova! What's going on? Wow! Die! Take her onto the battleship. Lose them in the clouds. Alright, let's see what this baby's got. These 
fire! Who gave you orders to attack? Lighten up! I'm just having a little fun. When can we take them out? Why don't we just blow them to bits and sift through for the end, Magnus, later? No! Cease fire, you fools! The Divine Child is on that ship. What? That's impossible. It died two years ago. But Callus survived. They were both mortally wounded. Yet somehow he lives. True, but the Divine Child? Why isn't the Child with Callus? Where is it now? Patience. We'll have all the answers in time. We cannot allow the Divine Child to pass away. Not just yet. Tja, da sind wir wohl abgestürzt. Na, solange dem kleinen Tierchen da nichts passiert ist, dem scheint es ja noch gut zu gehen. Ey, Liut, pst, aufstehen. Hey, Liut, komm zu dir. Es geht schon, aber wo sind wir? Schella? Schella, Schella. Bist du in Ordnung? Äh, äh. Ah, Kellis, mir fehlt nichts. Bist du unverletzt? Ja, geht so. Gut. Ich glaube, ich bin auch unverletzt. Mein Rücken schmerzt allerdings. Savina. Hey, Savina. Wir waren nicht auf der Hut. Wie geht's den anderen? Gucken wir mal, wie es Gibari geht. Der fällt der ja fast raus. Gibari, komm zu dir. Wach auf, Gibari. Oh, Kellis. Alles in Ordnung, Kleiner? Ja, alles bestens. Wo ist die Goldoba? Ist sie weg? Tja, ich schätze, wir wären erledigt, wenn sie noch da wäre. Wir waren mit die Ruhe und sehen uns um. Easy, kid. It's no use to panic. When you're in a jam like this, the best thing to do is sit back, relax, and wait. Sooner or later, something will pop up. Looks like we've fallen into one of the otherworldly planes surrounding Mira. If so, getting back isn't going to be easy. Then again, there must be a way out of here. Gibari made a good point. We should calm down and consider our predicament carefully. I've never heard of anyone getting out of here alive. As I always say, que sera sera. Na klasse. Cast light upon the darkened earth. Save those lost in despair. Almighty ocean, guide us as we journey through. The dark oh, verdammt, ich wollte es nicht verklicken. The darkest pit of night. Huh. Yes. All life will eventually return to the sea. That's my nation's prayer. The one I said in Moonguile Forest, where we first met. You know it by heart.
What are you doing out here? Haben die sich nicht das erste Mal in Saberai gesehen? Wir haben sie doch da angesprochen, wo sie an der Brücke stand. Nothing, really. I was just thinking. Thinking? About the end Magnus. R, Le, Chet. The only one we have is the one they call Chet. What the heck are these things? So they contain Malpercio's power. The power of an ancient evil god. But what exactly are they? I don't know. Some things in life we're just not supposed to know. By the way, Callus, you said you're from Mira, right? Did you hear any stories back home about the N. Magnus? No, nothing that comes to mind. I see. Which part of Mira did you grow up in? I don't know. You don't know? I never knew my parents. My grandfather found me when I was a child. The first thing I remember is living with Gramps and Fee. I'm sorry. I didn't know. Hey, don't be. What's wrong, Mimai? What is that? Huh? Where? Swaying on the waves, the flowing waves, how far shall we go? Tonight, ta la di da di da, ta la di da. To the rounded moon, to the scarlet star, to your slumbering island of afar, ta la di da di da, ta la di da. Oh, mighty sun, scatter long, a flower fresh become. Oh, sweet flower blooming shower, a guiding path in times to come. Two souls swaying on a sea of dreams, praying. Traveling unto kingdom come, two small vessels of one long endeavor. Hey, stop right there. Who or what are you? I be the great Mizud. What you be doing here? The great Mizudi? Correct. The great Mizuti thinks, therefore the great Mizuti be. The great Mizuti was headed from Mira, but took a wrong turn somewhere. Just a little wrong turn. Do you, uh, would the great Mizuti happen to know the way to Mira? Oh yes, of course. The great Mizuti be here by accident. Great Mizuti couldn't possibly be disoriented. Most definitely not. I'm not sure I understand all this, but we're headed for Mira as well. Would the great Mizuti kindly take us along? Why not? You should follow the great Mizuti. The great Mizuti has our gratitude. Go ask Gibari to fire up the ship. Hey, wait! Shella! Don't tell me you actually trust! Huh? 
Tja, da haben wir aber einen ziemlich seltsamen Kauz gefunden, oder? Naja, wir werden jetzt an dieser Stelle eine klitzekleine Pause einlegen. Und beim nächsten Mal geht es dann an dieser Stelle weiter, wenn wir dann hoffentlich im Mirror ankommen werden. Das wäre ziemlich toll. Wie gesagt, wir machen jetzt eine Pause. Sehen Sie dann beim nächsten Mal wieder hoffentlich. Und ich hoffe, ihr seid dann auch wieder mit dabei. Würde mich zumindest sehr freuen. Und naja, ich wünsche euch noch einen schönen Tag. Bleibt gesund und bis zum nächsten Mal. Verabschiede mich wie immer. Bleibt ciao.